Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today we're going to show you how we clean the new bed. Okay. So, a neglected part of um when it comes to keeping people's cars clean is under the hood, the engine bay. Um so I'm going to show you how I personally clean it. I clean it maybe once every 3-4 months. I mean, it does get pretty dirty if you let it. So right now it's actually not that bad. I mean, there's a little bit of dust here and there on the cooler intake, on the engine bay a little bit, um, and some of the pieces here, hoses. Um, but I know some people say like they directly sp spray with water first and stuff. I don't risk that because there's a lot of electrical components here too, and a lot of hoses. Um, so I'd rather not do that. What I do is use two products. <laughs> I use Adam's time rubber cleaner on like the rubber parts. You got kind of like a rubber trimming here, some in the back over there. Um, and on some of the hoses, I use this on them. And for everything else, metal and plastic, I use Adam's waterless wash. And if I don't see any hoses or wires around, I'll spray it directly on the surface and then just clean it up with a microfiber towel and this waterless wash is pretty good too you could you could even use it on the on your car's exterior but yeah and you could also apply the the um the chemical directly on your microfiber towel if you don't want to risk spraying any part of the under your hood but I mean, as long as you don't go overboard with it, you should be fine. But yeah, I mean, non if you want to like, if you're going to like a car meetup and you're going to pop your hood or whatever, I'll definitely recommend you cleaning up under your hood. Well, that's basically it. You do the same thing with like the rubber part with the other chemical. I mean, you don't have to use Adam's polishes, but that's what's worked best for me so far. So that's what I use. Well, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. I mean, nothing to it. So, all right, guys. So um, I skipped to the part where I'm finished. I mean, I kind of didn't go all out, but you can see how that looks way better now. You don't got all those water marks. I removed most of the dust. Um, the engine cover is a little tricky. I'm probably gonna go over that again, but see that back piece rubber had water marks and dirt all over it. Okay, now it look, almost looks brand new. Um, over here, I think I showed you guys. Yeah, it was full of water marks up here. I got rid of most of them. So the chemicals work fine. You just gotta put in the work. And, but yeah. Now, you'll be show ready if you want to pop your hood at a car show or a car meet up. Um, you'll be all set, but yeah. That's pretty much it. Straight to the point. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. And we'll catch you on the next one.